Diana Frazier. I serve on the board here with Christian Lead Clinics of Philadelphia for about six years, I think, and I'm a member of Crescent Valley Church in Philadelphia. As I've thought about my relationship with uh, CLCP over the years, as a board member and as just as a participant and as somebody who supports the organization, I've always been compelled to pray for the work itself, for the, the attorneys, for the staff, for the uh, clients coming in, for the neighborhoods that the clients reside in. The prayer walk itself is inspiring and drew me to it because it's you're right there in the same neighborhood, in the streets, looking at the stores, the homes, seeing the people who are coming in for services. Well, it's interesting. I, I was with a small group of people, which included my sister-in-law and her husband. And what kept coming up was actually the moments of joy the flowers, somebody had just freshly painted a home, a yard was well done, some children, you know, skipping down the street holding hands. That actually was a very important part. And sometimes I think when we uh, engage in prayer, we only think of the, the difficult things people are going for and we going through, and we don't always rejoice in the same, you know, what they have as well. So to me that, this year in particular, that stood out. So we prayed a lot for the business owners and um, for them to prosper and for them to you know, continue to benefit the neighborhood. That was a little different from other years and that's really been lingering on my mind because you need, you need each neighborhood to be vibrant, to be self-sustaining, to have a local school, to have a local church, to have local stores, that kind of things. And I think we just have to, to remember that God's calling us in this moment to be here for this purpose and rest in Him that He is caring for His people.